What's up guys, Neo here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm gonna show you how to apply a different wallpaper for each of the home screen pages you have on your Android device. To get this process started, head on over to the Google Play Store and install the free application called Five Wallpapers. There are other applications that claim to do this, but I tested a few of them and this one seemed to work the best and didn't ruin the resolution of the images that I chose. Once installed, go ahead and launch the application. Now within these settings, there are a few things you can adjust. Now up top, you'll see the pages you have on your home screen. If it doesn't number them, you can go ahead and just tap number of desktops if it doesn't do it automatically. Now right here you have set. You can pick multiple sets, which is essentially just a different profile. You can set up three different home screen pages or wallpapers and you can switch between them whenever you want. This is the set I currently have, so I'm gonna leave this. And then you also have transition effect, so when you swipe, there'll be an effect for that. Let's just go ahead and apply one just for the sake of this video. Let's do blinds. You can have a 3D effect, adjust the sensitivity. Then you have compatibility mode. If it doesn't work for your device or the launcher, you can go ahead and toggle this on. Uh, mine works, works well on TouchWiz. Then you have auto change if you wanna change the image every time you double tap, every time you shake, which may cause um, some battery drain, but if you want to change your wallpaper like that, you can go ahead and opt in to do that. So let's head back to the top and just select different images. So I'm just gonna go ahead and let's just tap the middle one, then you can navigate through your device to a particular folder and just apply a wallpaper that you like. Let's just do this one and hit okay. Now if I want to edit any of the images, all I have to do is tap and hold on it. And from here I can crop it and I can tweak out the image as much as I want. I can also make it landscape. So let's just leave it as is and let's just go home now. Now when you go back to your home screen, just go ahead and swipe and you should see your new wallpapers pop up as well as the transition effect if you applied one. I'm not necessarily digging the transition effect, but it's a nice little touch that the application includes. For more information and download links, definitely check out the full guide over at GadgetHacks.com. And as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for some more awesome and very useful Gadget Hack videos. Thanks guys.